Hi, in this tutorial we are going to discuss next interview question which is why main method is static in Java. Now before discussing why main is static, let's discuss how we can access a member function of a class in another class. Let's suppose if we have a class test where we have one static method and one method here is non-static. Now suppose these methods are to be accessed in some other class, let's say class sample. Now what can be done over here? When we have to access this static function, your class sample can access this directly with the class name because static is associated with the class and not with the instance so it can be invoked directly by giving the class name dot operator and the method name but when the sample class needs to access this non-static method it can be done only by creating the instance of the class so what it need to first do is it needs to first create the instance of test class and with the instance it can call the non-static method so this is clear that whenever a member function is to be accessed outside the class if it is static it can be accessed with the class name but if it is non-static it can be accessed with the instance only so, so the first requirement is to create the instance and then method can be called now getting back to main method main method in java by default is static we know that main method is the entry point of execution that is the place from where execution begins for your code and this main method is invoked implicitly by JVM. So had it not been static what was required to be done by JVM if the main method was non-static then first instance was required to be created by JVM for our class and then with that instance this main method could be called. Now since this is static by default what JVM needs to do is it needs to just call the main method with the class name. So to avoid this effort of creating instance of our class and then invoking the main method by default main method is static in Java. Thank you for watching this tutorial.